Hello everybody, welcome back to a new video here on the channel. My name is Patrick, also known as Neketus, and today I'm making a quick little video. It's more of a rant. I wanted to make a statement about AI and my positions on artificial intelligence, specifically artificial general intelligence. Personally, I have no problem with artificial intelligence in the use of, say, like, medical research or even artificial intelligence used, like, in ray tracing or, like, image and audio denoising. However, I do have extreme um, negative views on artificial intelligence in the form of general artificial intelligence, uh, in the form of gen image generation artificial intelligence and audio generation artificial intelligence. I think using generative AI to generate images of any any for any reason, even if they're trained on ethically sourced data and uh, audio generation. Um, even for like things like samples, wrong, immoral, disgusting. Uh, currently, there are no models at all that are ethically sourced. Even if you look at, say, like Adobe's, like I think it's called Adobe Firefly, their image generation or their background image generation service, um, all those artists that it was trained on, they did not agree to it. It was using libraries. Um, of, uh, you know, what's the word I'm looking stock images where artists post stock images to sell. However, the people who posted the stock images on those websites did not agree for their images to be used for this training data at all. And in fact, from what I can see, almost all of them don't agree with it and do not like this. On top of that, Photoshop is training on data that you put into Photoshop and your work and they reserve to write to train anything off of your work which is absolutely absurd um, even things like you know look at like what Ben Jordan is doing with his voice swap AI the fundamentals of the AI system that is being used there is just frankly unethical I mean and he's doing it in the most ethical way possible and it's still gross because the models themselves that he is using all he's doing is fine-tuning the model towards a certain data set. The, the model was constructed off of unethically sourced uh, uh, sources that people do not, do, did not agree to. Um, so at its core, I don't think generative AI could be done in an ethical training model regardless um, because they all are based off of code that is already been trained to some extent of data that they don't have the licenses for and the people who created those data did not agree to I also think even if something is quote unquote public domain the like for example a long dead artist who are we to use their data in such a raw manner to train an AI off of I think that's also in of itself morally deplorable um, even though it is quote unquote uh, legal in all aspects, it's just wrong. And I do not want any of my work whatsoever to be used to train any sort of a generative AI. And if you support generative AI in any capacity, you do not support me or artists. And to be frank, if you're a quote unquote artist that is using generative AI, I do not view you as an artist. I've, you're basically a class trader. That's what you are to me. I think you're disgusting. And I want nothing to do with you. And if that means you unsubscribe from my channel, then please do. Because I don't want people who support generative AI anywhere near me. Because it is wrong. Just flat out immoral and disgusting. Now there are generative... There are AI services that aren't generative that I do support. Like Isotope with their um, audio uh, denoising services. Um, I even think, say, like Photoshop's uh, content aware fill or content remove is fine. Um, there are things where I think AI is incredibly useful um, that isn't taking jobs and isn't stealing data. However, there are also a lot of tools right now that just, if we were to enforce the laws we currently have in the way they were meant to be enforced, they, these these models would not exist just 
flat out. And they should not exist. Because they are immoral and wrong, unethical, and just blatant theft. On top of that, AI, especially generative AI, is inherently a disinflationary force for the economy. They do not create jobs. The purpose of them is to remove and disenfranchise workers, to replace jobs. This is a, a self-defeating system that will, frankly, completely erode capitalism. You cannot have generative AI in a capitalist system because the whole system would fall apart. Because nobody would have money in order to purchase the goods that require capitalism to keep functioning. So, there's just, it just makes no sense. None of this makes any sense. It is just wrong. It is disgusting. And it is counterintuitive and erodes the very systems of society on so many different levels whether it be like you can't trust what you see online or what you hear um you, you the system literally falls apart monetarily because of it um and you don't own anything anymore so not only is it like dystopian it just it literally it doesn't work we shouldn't be using this we shouldn't be okay with this. We should be advocating against this. And that's basically all I had to say about this. I just felt like it needed to be said that this channel is not only not supportive of AI, it is actively hostile towards generative AI and those who use it. Alright, well... I'll see you next time, and thanks for joining me on this rant, but I thought it was important. Patrick.